what up y'all i got a, the samsung admire doing another uh round review nah this time um i got cyanogen mod 7 installed on here um uh, yeah it's a pretty nice rom uh as you can see first off you got a different lock screen instead of sliders they got um the bubbles on here uh so yeah that's a nice little addition it looks kind of nice uh i don't know why it says digital roaming but that's um if you want to change uh, how the live screen look, in case you don't really like those bubbles, you can. All you got to do is go to settings, Cyanogen Mod settings, go down to where it says lock screen, and go to style options. When you scroll down, um, you could click on ring lock style. See right here where it says ring lock style? Click there. Now, revamp style. Show you how it looks. Slightly different. Now this is just for they they all look they all got a, a ring look to them. You see. That's a ring lock style. Now you can change it to where it's not a ring. If you go to lock screen style, now you can go to slide and tab. That's if you want sliders. Now you can get the sliders back if you like the sliders. You know. Some people prefer sliders, rotary, and you know you got the rotary, um, you got the rotary style with the arrow, uh, you know. You know, just different little lock screens. Uh, let me show you how the the boot animation looks. Uh, yeah, this overall it's, it's a nice ROM. Uh, one thing I don't think the camera works. That's a nice boot animation. I really don't know for sure though. Um, this phone is not even activated, so I don't even know exactly what works and what doesn't work. Um, all I can say is um, install it for yourself and see. I mean, you know, just test it out and see how you like it. Um, now nah, it comes pre-installed with ADW launcher. ADW launcher makes the phone seem like it's not that responsible. I never was a fan of ADW launcher. Uh, it's just it's too slow for me. But um, yeah, it's a it's a nice ROM. I think y'all gonna like it. Uh, it comes with theme chooser, of course, so you'll be able to uh, select different themes. But yeah, test it out and see how it works. Nah, as you know, Cyanogen Mod it comes with a uh, theme chooser. So you know, if you don't like the stock look, you can always switch it up and uh, you know, everything could change. The dialer change, the notification bar change, um, the Google search bar will change. Uh, the music widget will probably change. Um, the settings, all this shit look plain. You know, this shit look plain, colorless and shit. I never like the plain stock look. So, uh, yeah, it's a few things that I already got already on here. I got some um, theme chooser themes. I'll go through a few of them for y'all. Uh, this one is called Elegant Steel. Hit apply. Apply anyways. So, yeah, the, the notification bar and status bar changed up a little bit. The dialer is transparent, looks a little better. Call log is transparent. The context list is transparent. Now, um, also the call screen can change up too. 
see, yeah, it got a little different look to it. Um, yeah. The uh, music widget kind of switched up too. You can't see it in the camera, but it's a little transparent. Just a little bit. Let's go to the settings. Um, the settings icons changed up a little bit. Let's see what the sliders look like. Yeah, it looked better. I like this one better. Um, the selection uh, background looks a little better too. Um, yeah, let's go to another thing. Uh, this one is called Ginger Blur. So yeah, look at the Google bar. Uh, yeah, the music widget. Dialer looks different. This one looks way better, much better. Uh, the contact icon kind of switched up, and the the selections look a little different. Um, the notification bar looks different see the little icons up there um, all the icons changed up they look a lot better let's go to another thing uh, this one is HTC elegance um, okay so the icons changed up widgets changed Uh, this dialer looks stock. Notification bar is slightly different. Oh, those settings icons look way better. Let's see. Now the sliders look different too. Look much better. The selection is green. Let's go to another thing. Next is honey bread. Now this one, it, um, yeah, it's like honeycomb. It looks nice though. It got like a everything got has a glow around it dialer icons look a little different oh, the settings look kinda plain but it's not bad sliders are different yeah so you know mostly ev mostly everything about the phone changes when you apply a theme some of the icons is a little different settings phone messaging now this one is touch Wiz. a lot of y'all know what touch Wiz is already the way those this widget look look nice notification bar is a little different the dialer wow that one look way better that's one of the best ones Yeah, touch wheels is always nice. Okay, let's go to another one. Now this is this one is called Xperia. I guess it's based off of the Sony Ericsson Xperia phone. I don't know. 
this is my first time looking at it myself. Different music widget. Different dialer. Different contact icons. Now a lot of these themes, um, a lot of these themes has their own wallpapers. So, but it you can't you gotta go to the market and you gotta search for an app called Theme Chooser Wallpapers. Once you download that app, then you will be able to um, change the wallpaper to the uh, according to what theme you got installed. See, right now all you have is Cyanogen Mod wallpapers. Um, they kind of nice. They not bad. Y'all should um y'all should most definitely try to download this ROM and uh you know install it and see how you like it yourself um and see what what all works. I think mostly everything works. I really don't know because um this phone is not activated. I don't even use this phone. I just um do reviews on it. If you need to know how to install this ROM, uh, I can make a tutorial video um and show you how to do that. Uh, but yeah, it's not real. Hard. It's, it's real simple yeah but this is a nice rhyme it's pretty nice pretty responsive I mean ADW launcher will make it seem like it's not that responsive but that's just ADW launcher you should go into the Play Store and download another launcher yourself because ADW is just some bullshit but um any other questions leave them in the comments make sure you subscribe to my channel um alright I'm out